Hello everyone, watch this review here with a look at Rampage from the G.I. Joe Rise of Cobra line. Uh, this, this isn't Rampage. Rampage is this little guy over here. This is just the Rhino tank that he comes with. You know, it's just one big giant accessory because, you know, you'd be buying this thing just for the Rampage. But it's the original box that he came in. He, of course, was in the plastic portion here. And there's a little read-up on this character, if you care to read it. Basically just explains that he's an expert driver and stuff, but, you know, if you're driving something this big, you kind of have to be an expert, and you kind of assume that, but here's Rampage. Not a uh, bad-looking figure. He does have a little peg hole in here in the back. Let me uh, get this giant distraction out of the way. Just toss it down there for the time being. Now he comes with a few accessories. First off, a helmet. Because when you're driving something like that, you might want to use a helmet. Or for the helicopter, actually. And again, he looks pretty decent in it. Hmm. Alright, uh, one second. <laughs> if you just missed that, I accidentally popped his head off when I was trying to, uh, get the helmet off. Uh, the helmet fits really, really snugly around him, and unfortunately, when you're trying to remove it, you probably will pop the head off at least a few times until the helmet loosens up, assuming it ever does. But I was saying that I actually prefer the look of this character without the helmet because it's a pretty decent looking head sculpt, so probably leave him without it. But uh, the other accessories here are first off, the golden gun, which he no doubt won from Scaramanga in a poker contest, and you know, one bullet from this will kill anything. Well, depending on what version of the game you play, but. Yeah, obviously that's not the story here, but it fits into this side holster. Yeah, kind of snugly. I'm not sure that it'll really stay in there when he's seated inside the plane, though. In addition to this rifle here, which is interesting simply because it has a clip. Which means you don't often see like a separate clip accessory for these weapons. Alright, I can't get it in there, but, you know, that's what it presumably is for. I'm not sure why they gave two of them, because there's only one place you can pop them and no places you can store them. So, I mean, if somebody can figure out a reason, just let me know. But as for the figure itself, I really like the amount of detail on him. Um, not a lot of paint variation or anything like that. I mean, it mostly sells itself on the sculpt, and I mean, the slight gloss on the jacket does kind of work. So you can kind of imagine that for a leather or whatever, but I mean, the gloss in the inner outfit doesn't look as nice. But you'll notice that he has two belts on. I guess the second one's actually for the holster here. This three number here. And then he has a spot for second gun here. But it's a non-removable, a spot for a knife. Again, not removable. Khaki pockets and stuff. So yeah, um, definitely a decent design. And a nice extra, or if you consider the actual vehicle an extra. For this set, but yeah, let me just quickly run through articulation. Rotating wrist. Ball and socket at elbow, but it won't go all the way up, which is unfortunate. Due to the sculpt. Uh, also don't know why that would be, just because you'd think that you'd need the extra just for uh, posing him inside his vehicle. Normal shoulder, though. No real complaints. The head can look up a fair deal, but then just pops off. It's just not on there all that secure, but the ball joint goes up and down a fair amount. 
I think it pops up mostly because the jacket goes up so far in the back. The jacket's not removable to the best of my knowledge. He has a torso joint here. No waist joint. A standard ball joint on leg. Which of course you need for flying these things. Um, double pin here at knee and then a ball and socket here on the foot. So I mean pretty standard figure but it does look pretty nice and I do like the look of this character. So yeah, um, this has been Rampage. Uh, until next time, folks.